Hello everybody, today we got a project. So, ordered two more of those big media shelves in the center. I know I haven't really showed my games yet, but the reason for that is because, like, <laughs> these are ones that I was gonna keep, that there's, there's a lot of, it's unorganized because there's no room. I mean, these shelves are packed, so. And as well, there's some over here, and there's just other stuff everywhere that I would like to have over here. But I can't because I have no room. So ordered two more of these media shelves. I got them from Best Buy. And there they are. They're the 72 inch or whatever. Um, I liked, I really like them. I have two already. And they're nothing crazy in terms of quality, but they do the job. And we measured in the four of them. So I have two here and then we're going to add the other two. The four will fit perfectly across this wall. So that should look fantastic, hopefully. <laughs> so yeah, I'm basically gonna take you guys along for the ride here, I guess, in this project. So I'm gonna clear all these games down and I'll meet back up with you. I don't know, I'm probably gonna leave these ones for now. Clear off these shelves, like put all these PS1 games in the bins and the Sega games. But yeah, so this is kind of how I have it set up now. It's not bad. So I have these these smaller shelves I'm going to be using probably for like eBay inventory stuff. But for right now, they have, like there's all my PS1 games, and Dreamcast games, Sega games. There's some stuff here. You know, I'm going to go over everything. I'll make a whole video of I guess my game collection, majority of it once we have the new shelf set up and then for right now here's how my super nintendo games look my n64 games and then we also have this sega shelf over here which i think i may end up putting all of those on the new black shelves so they're all kind of together that's kind of the one thing i didn't like about this like i probably could have organized it better but like there's like Xbox 360 games and then original Xbox is up there. It just doesn't really make sense. So I'm going to try to put everything in order. And yeah, so hopefully it looks good. And so yeah, let's get started. Okay, so all the games are moved off the shelves and they're on these bins. And we got some wall space. So I think now I'm going to build another shelf. We got that one moved over, so... Yeah, I guess I'm going to get to building. All right, guys, shelf number one is complete. Now it's time for the next one. It took about an hour and a half to build, so it was a lot of work. But let's do the next one, and yeah, let's see how it looks. Okay, last shelf built, and we moved them to where they all fit on the wall. So now let's reorganize these games and actually put some stuff on the shelves. All right, guys, so we're def so disclaimer, we're definitely not done yet, but we're definitely getting there. This is going to be the last portion of this video. I'm going to make a detailed video showing what's all on these shelves. But as you can see, there's definitely stuff on them. There's still more that I need to add, so we're not going to have much room. And a lot of my handheld stuff's still down here. So what I'm thinking is my handheld stuff I'm going to put in a different area. Just leave this all the console stuff. So anyway, I don't really know what to say, but I just kind of wanted to show the progress, I guess, of these new shelves getting put in and look forward soon to a new video showing what's in here. I might go by section, like, for example, like show all the Super Nintendo games and kind of talk about them. Or I might just do the whole thing, but who knows. Um, so, yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, thanks so much for watching and stay tuned for a detailed look at these games. All right, later.